We're broadcasting live from the Dirty South Dome in Atlanta, Georgia, where it's so humid you can drink the air. You know what? You can drink the air, Grim. I'll stick with my cough syrup and scotch with a beer chaser, thank you. While we're on this subject, anyone seen my airplane blue or whipped cream? And today's matchup is going to be a good one. The teams are taking the field. The Philadelphia Eagles go up against the Atlanta Vultures. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. If you're just waking up wondering who put that vice on your head and filled your mouth with vacuum cleaner, dirt, and can litter, you're not alone. After all, it's Sunday, MFL game day. Hey, you look tired, Junior. And Bricks, you look like they just used your head in field goal practice. Spent all night in the ER. We ate Chinese food last night. Food poisoning? I wish! I got the chopsticks lodged in my ears again. You know, they should have a warning on them things. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot three. And an eight-yard gain on that one. Like when Bricks' mom decided to move back in with us. Second down and two. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. I see this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 Hot three. Hey, that was a nice piece of running, Grim. That's a first down. And it's first and ten. Hey kids, do you remember getting shoved in a locker because you wore glasses? I do. Join the MFL and try Roid Rage and have your revenge. It's a touchdown! Hey, yeah, uh, Bricks, check the rule book. Is that a penalty? Why would I have the rule book? Oh, for fuck's sake. They're back up here on first, and they've had enough. The offense jumps off sides and attacks the ref. First down in a mile. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot eight. Come on, man, you gotta catch that. I don't catch anything, Grim. I'm retired. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. One, hot two, hot three. And the defense gave up a lot of yards on that pass play. They'll need to regroup quickly. Third down and long. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot three. Oh, good run. He nearly broke it open, Bricks. Yeah, I nearly blew three times the legal limit last night leaving the stadium. And I nearly did not get arrested, get thrown face first into a paddy wagon, get taken for a rough ride. And I nearly did not have prison sex and lockup last night. Nearly. He's got the distance, and the kick is good. <laughs> the home team is feeling confident as they get the kick off into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. And it's 
first and ten. That ball just sliced through the defense like butter. I wish defenses were made out of butter. That'd be fantastic. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. And it's first and ten. that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. Nicely done for a first down. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. And he punched his way out of that tent, and they run it for a couple of yards. And that'll be second and eight to go. Hot one, hot two, eight. He That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. First down to seven. Hot, hot one, hot two. Four yards on that one, and he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. Second and three. And the defense was ready for that bombs away dirty trick that time. Third down and three. Quarterback passes for a touchdown. Some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. Straight through the uprights. <laughs> the best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. And he picks up 
two yards on the catch. It's anyone's game still at this point. I know, which makes it so hard to place a bat. And that'll be second and eight to go. He blasted and picks up seven yards right there. Third and two. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. And he'll pick up seven yards on that play. Second and three. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot, hot, hot. Welcome to McRoy Bridge. How can I help you? Yeah, I'll take it. Well, it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it. You gotta keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirt. Third down and three. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot. He is running like an old guy looking for a bathroom. First down. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. First down and don't die. See, it's really. If you get one more bullshit penalty, you get one more for free. You'll also probably lose the game. Just do the attack ref dirty trick. First down and long. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. down and forever. Whoa, and he laterals the ball to the player behind him. The ground game should be their bread and butter. A gain of eight right there. Hey, anyone seen that Korean kid yet with my barbecue? Last time I ordered Korean, I got Kim Jong-il. The quarterback passes the ball and it rebounds back. He can't get rid of it. It's like me and these crabs, Grim. Yep, the defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick, and the QB is in a heap of trouble now. Third down, and the QB is saying his prayers. Sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. And that punter gets paid way too much to kick like that. No return on this punt. The defense will just down it. I can't tell if he's smart or scared. Either way, the ball is down. And it's first and ten. And the ground game is starting to soften up the defense. First down. And it's first and ten. Oh, my gosh! The defense! A good run for five yards. Hey, didn't move to change his score, did it? How good can it be? Second down and five. It's a brutal hit. And it's first.
first and ten. That's a nice gain of about seven yards on that run. Second and three. And this guy's like a human cannonball. First down. Yeah, my next door neighbor was a human cannonball, Grim. He drowned in his pool. And it's first and ten. And we're at the two-minute warning. I got to pee. Second down in a lot. save your timeouts, you can use them in the two-minute warning. Now I get it. Makes sense, Grim. And it's first and ten. <laughs> and he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. First down and three. And into the end zone with a burst of speed. I think he's more of a downest guy than a speed thing, Grim. He's running from his team, as it's clear. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It's good. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chip wrestles away from that tackle. And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Brent's match stopsing time. That's why the girls call me Speedy Gonzalez. Oh, he just got crushed. Second and three. And they take their first time out. Well, how predictable. Surprise us next time. Call the timeout during halftime. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. And it's first and... They've got one more timeout left, but they've stopped the clock. Why don't they just take the batteries out of the clock, Grim? That would make more sense. Well, I hope the kicker ate his bleedies this morning. It's good. <laughs> when you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked? What do you do then? Run. The second quarter comes to a close as the teams head for the locker room, and we take you to halftime. 
brought to you by Monsatan Industries. We make genetically engineered food that is to die for. And these guys are neck and neck to begin the third quarter. You talking about them two Siamese twins playing opposing tackles? Yeah, they're putting on a hell of a show. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Into a four yard pickup there. Second down and six. Ouch! What is this? Annie's wrestling? And it's first and ten. Roid Rage, how do you like your brains? Scrambled or fried? One Roid Rage breakfast special coming up. You ever have a bottle of hot sauce shoved up your ass? Quite the description of that painful head, Junior. Huh? No, no, it's a question here on this online dating profile. It doesn't say if on purpose or by accident. Yeah, I'll leave it blank. First and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. I'm a house camel on Silla. I am a yellow on Silla. And they line up for the extra point. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just guineas. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. First and ten. Oh, wait, the quarterback said they'd blow up the defense today. <laughs> he was right. Second down and ten. Roid Rage ignites that deep down violent rage and makes you unstoppable. I'll take a Roid Rage. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. And it's first and ten. First down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. And it's first and ten. Oh, he's going berserk. The ball carrier better walk. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Well, of course, he, he could have had an interception. Turned it for a touchdown and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. 
I do. The guy should have fucking caught it. Second down and ten. That's a four-yard gain. Third down and six. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! Hey, Bricks, they're going for two here. <laughs> the best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Oh, devastating hit! You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep, third grade. Sister Mary Margaret and our ladies of holy hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. And he was running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Uh, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. It's a pretty good defensive tool. Yeah, except the zombies. They are freaks. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. And it's first and ten. Oh, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Grim. Second down and long. The defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick. The quarterback can't dump it. And now they're going to dump his ass. down and never going to happen. He picks up eight yards on that pass. The kicker should make this, but you know how it goes in this league. right through yeah like a double stuff burrito from top at some point they're gonna need to put this ref out of his misery uh how about now for instance here's a hint dirty tricks attack the ref <laughs> and the offense jumps on sides to kill the ref they say we're mad as hell and not gonna take it anymore No, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. Oh, no good. Now that punter's going to find a cutoff bison hit. He just let that one drop and played safe, and the defense says we'll take it. And it's first and ten. And with a burst of speed, 
He finds an opening and the first down. And it's first and ten. That's the end of three, and it's anyone's game. Hang on tight. The fourth quarter is about to begin. And it's first and ten. Oh, and the ball falls to the ground. That's incomplete. He needs to throw it when a receiver can catch it. What's he doing? And uh, groundbreaking analysis, as always there, Bricks. Oh, thank you. I do my part. First down. And this guy is a stud, Bricks. Yeah, tell him me. Nice run. No, I mean, he's a real stud. He works at the Mutant Stud Farm weekends and summers. First and ten. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. And it's first and ten. was an all-pro NFL hit. First down and six. He picks up five on that play. And that'll bring up second and one. And he breaks through for a touchdown. Listen to this crowd. Yay. Should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. They're going to be able to return this one. With the punishing hit. And it's first and ten. And that's how you shuck the monkey. Thunderclap. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. And it's first and ten. And an eight-yard gain on that one. Like when Bricks' mom decided to move back in with us. Second down and two. When the defense calls Thunderclap, the offense is toast. Oh, did he ever get zapped? Reminds me, you ever hear that Zappa song, Watch Out Where the Huskies Go, Don't You Eat That Yellow Snow? When I was a kid, I always ate the yellow snow. They were like lemon snow cones. But them fudge ice cream sandwiches, eh, they didn't taste so good. Boom! 
Second down and ten. Oh, and he might have just saved a touchdown on that deflection. Third down and ten. chip shot here extra point but this guy could blow it straight through the uprights here comes the kicker oh, I can't wait to hear this what's the kicker Grim? Uh, this guy in the field oh I thought you were gonna tell me a story like here's the kicker when I turned on the light it wasn't a broad in my bed it was a chick wearing a wig Nice hit. And it's first and ten. That ball was almost intercepted. Second down and ten. Like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, it sounds like my off season. And the quarterback goes into a hurry up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. Oh man, he really. Oh, and the quarterback threads the needle for a first down. And it's first and ten. And they stop the clock with their first time out to try and stay in this game. Oh, nice coaching move there. Hall of Fame caliber. Well, I mean, it's a pretty standard coaching move at this point of the game. I won't listen to this blasphemy. Oh, and that one's going to hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's that? They stop the clock, but they only have one timeout left. Oh, that's okay, Grim. They can have mine. That's, uh, that's nice, Bricks. But our timeouts are for our sponsors, and we need money more than they do. Oh, great catch, and that's a touchdown! Touchdown! Should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> the kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The kicker's going to have to kick the ball just right so his team can recover it. The four people on the planet who care about rules and kickoffs must be happy to see a flag down. I'm just happy to see anything after that laser pointer accident. Yeah, but... Looks like they're lined up for an onside kick. Uh, I thought they were going to do some sort of course. Oh, come on. It's not that hard to kick, is it? Because this guy's making it look really hard. Eh, maybe he's just having a bad leg day. Yeah, I get those. You know, the Jimmy leg. Every day with you is a fucking bad everything day. And it's first and ten. Oh, what the brutal hit. And defense calls its final timeout. Good. I gotta run to the John. That means I gotta deal with that grubby little bathroom attendant again. Always pushing his lifesaver's dirty comb, hairspray, cheap cologne on me. Hey, I'm here to take a crap. Not get ready for a date. Well, you never know. First down. He was not gonna drop that one. They need to make him a 
target more often. And it's first and ten. And he rumbles for nine on that play. And that'll bring up second and one.